So the biggest question in real estate right now, should I sell my house? And yeah, that is one of the biggest questions right now. Should I sell my house right now throughout this craziness that's going on? And should I buy a house that's going on? I just don't know what to do. We're gonna jump on that as soon as I get this business out of the way and straight into it. Steve Arthur and I am a local realtor here in the Long Beach area and all of the surrounding cities powered by nationwide real estate executives. Now if this is our first time meeting here on YouTube go ahead and hit that subscribe button somewhere right there. Ring that bell so that you're gonna be notified every time that I do put out a video and at the end if you feel so please give me a like. I do put a lot of hard work and I could use a little pat on the back from these okay. But if you or anybody that you may know is thinking about moving to the Long Beach area or moving out of the Long Beach area, all you gotta do is give me a call, shoot me a text, send an email, or just register on my website for your free gift, and I will personally get hold of you. All my information is down below. Let's get back to this top. So one of the most important responsibilities of a realtor is to make sure that we relay great information to you that is also useful to you as a seller and useful to you as a buyer. First question, you own a home, is now the best time to sell? It may be your personal residence, it may be a vacation home, an Airbnb, whatever. So to be direct with you, if you've been thinking about moving, downsizing, whatever in the next two years, yes, do it now. The sooner, the better. Well, why is that? Well, first off, if you are happy in your home, you can afford it, you love the neighborhood, you love the people, you love everything about it, well, don't move. Don't move because the market is telling you that your home is worth the most it's ever been and da 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 don't feel that pressure. If you love it where you are, just stay put. But if you've been thinking about moving, downsizing, getting closer to your friends and family, and if selling your home when you can get the most amount for it is important to you, well, we've probably passed that peak. So you hear about prices going up all around the country. Well, that's just all temporary for a whole lot of reasons. But the truth is we do not know how long this incredibly hot market is gonna last for sellers. And one of the reasons why we don't know how long this will last for sellers is because there is a lot of pent up demand. There has been very low inventory and more buyers than sellers for a long time. So buyers have been wanting to buy and the interest rates are just historically insanely low. So these buyers are still wanting to buy. So we don't know how long this will last. Why is now a great time to sell? Well, due to all this craziness, all this stuff that everybody's sick and tired of, I know I am, well, businesses are hurting, jobs are hurting, and some people just might not have a job to go back to. Meaning that 10% of all American homeowners right now are not paying their mortgages. They are in forbearance. Now, at the end of the year, that forbearance runs out. Now, they can extend it another six months, but at the end of that six months, there is no more forbearance. Forbearances will be gone. People are trying to get back to normalcy at some point. All this government stimulus, the government being your backstop for your financials, it's going to go away. And at that point, going to be a lot of people who don't have jobs, whose income has dropped or just disappeared completely. They've been looking for jobs and not able to find anything, and they've been staying in their home because they haven't had to make their payment. Well, so at the end of that forbearance, they're gonna have to start making payments and they can't. So you're gonna have one big chunk of inventory hit the real estate market, giving buyers more to choose from. And there's not gonna be an increased buyer demand, so all of a sudden to equalize all of this, prices start to drop. So if you're thinking about selling in the next two years, now is the time to do it. Because right now, buyers are still buying, interest rates are still incredibly, insanely low, the home prices are still high. Now, if you're going to sell, the most important thing to do is make sure that you price your home correctly from the beginning. Because the worst thing in the world, the worst thing you can do is price your home where it just sits 
and then you end up chasing the market down if the market starts to drop. So you have two things that work against you if you don't price your home correctly from the beginning. Number one, and number one is the one that always works against you. When your house hits the market for the first couple of weeks, you always have the most buyer interest in your home because all the buyers are already out there looking for a house just like yours. Within the first two weeks, they're gonna come see your home, the virtual tours and all that kind of stuff. They're gonna look at all the pictures, the presentations that you have. And in the first two weeks, they either liked your home, checked it off their list or made an offer. So now you have to attract new buyers who are coming into the market and they tend to be more cautious and slower. Whereas people who have been in the market for a little while, they know that you have to put an offer in quick because maybe they've gotten involved in a multiple offer situation and lost out. So they realize the importance, whereas a new buyer, they tend to be more cautious and more slower. Or they come into your home, they love the home, but they just see it's overpriced. So by the time that you make that price correction, they've already gone on and put an offer on another home. So now you chase back those old buyers and they've pretty much checked your home off of their list due to it being overpriced. And if they do come back, they will come back with a price far less than what you were expecting. <laughs> Secondly, if the housing prices market start dropping, now you're not only dealing with days on market, but you're also dealing with chasing prices in a downward market. So if you're gonna sell, sell right now. And if you're gonna sell right now, price it aggressively from the beginning. It creates the best chances that you will sell your house with multiple offers. And when you sell a house with multiple offers, that's how you get the best price possible for your home. So if you're thinking about selling, should you sell now? And the answer to that is yes, absolutely, positively. Now, can you wait six months? Sure, you can wait six months or a couple, two, three months, and you'll probably be okay. But if the bottom drops out and consumer confidence stops and, and the Fed stop pumping money into the stock market, if people get scared and the stock market starts to drop, well, and you know the saying to that one. <laughs> and at that point, there is no bottom as to how far this could go. And if the stock market starts falling, people really start to freak out. Run! It's Godzilla! Because everything else in the economy is already bad. The stock market right now is just kind of making people feel like, eh, it's not really all that bad. So as long as that's happening, people will still buy a house. Congratulations on this exciting milestone. We wish you years of happiness. But when that goes bad, people are gonna be in a tailspin. And that could happen in three months, it could happen in six months, it could happen in 12 months. But right now with the economy and the economic indicators indicate that the prices of home are not realistically going to keep going up. We have passed the peak. So if you are thinking about selling, now is the time. Again, my name is Steve Arthur and I am a local realtor here in the Long Beach area and all of the surrounding city. So if you or anybody that you may know is thinking about relocating to the Long Beach area or move out of the Long Beach area, all you gotta do is give me a call, shoot me a text, send an email, or just register on my website for your free gift and I will personally reach out to you.